She is headed out for a test drive in just a few minutes. Woo! <laughs> Behind me is my van that I want, and I'm taking her for a test drive right now. And I'm pretty sure I'm saying yes. Just still have to figure out price. Duh! Super excited! Yeah, so I came up to this beautiful spot because I love it so much. Um, wow, the light's fabulous. So, I hope you can hear me, and uh, I hope this is, whew, my god, my hand is freezing. Okay, I can't even think of what to say because my hand is freezing, so I'm getting back in the car, or the van. Ah, the van! Oh my god, it is so windy out there. Holy moly. So, I'm really excited. This is, <laughs> I'm sitting in my my new van, because I am definitely saying yes to this van. This is yes to the van. Um, and so I'm gonna turn the camera around and let you guys see what the inside looks like. So here it is. Um, pretty raw, still enough of this stuff. He's gonna take the shelves out for me. So those are all gonna be gone. And so is the carpet and all that stuff, because that's all his stuff. So that's all gonna be gone. And um, so all I really need to do is make some covers for my windows. Bum, bum, bum. And then I can like just woo, hang. Um, see how far back I can get. Hang a curtain across there to a blackout curtain of sorts. I'll find a way to make one easy enough. I am really stoked. This is so cool. Um, and I'm looking forward to like figuring out how to make everything work in this space. Um, yay! I am squatting. I can't stand up in here. But I've also figured out I have a really low, I have a chair that goes down really low and that might work or I might like just find a little stool to sit on so that I'm not having to always be on my knees in this space. Um, but yeah, and maybe someday a swivel seat, all that kind of fun stuff. But right now, we're pretty basic. Oh, and I'm really excited about this. Wow, so here I am. Just finished my test drive. And she's over there. Yay! No need to say it. That, that, that. There she is. Um, so yeah, I told him yes, I want her. And today he's going to finish getting her fixed up. Like, he has to change the switch I said in the ignition. Um, not the ignition, the uh, shifter. Um, yes, I watched it suck gas as I drove. Um, and I know I never expected, and I had absolutely no delusions as to the gas mileage of this vehicle. Um, so I know my capacity to go great distances is not, um, something that I was really concerning myself with, right? So... If I can move slowly along and, uh, you know, make my way and make money as I go, I think I can certainly make this work. Um, so, no speed traveling. And if somebody wants me to go someplace, um, they can send me some gas money and get me there. Um, if they really want me there. Because <laughs> then I'd be more than happy to make a straight line. Um, and I don't think that's beyond possibility. Um, and, uh, who knows what doing all my paintings is going to garner and what kind of side work I'll find as I go. Um, I am willing to trust and I'm willing to give this a shot. Um, I don't have anything to lose. You know, I have nothing holding me down. So this is going to cost me a few thousand dollars to do to get ready to go, uh, most of which I've made already, some of which I still need, so I'm going to be working for a little while longer, 
um, up here and driving my dad's car while I work on the van, on the interior of the van. Um, and uh, so, so far this is where I am. I will know soon how much of a price tag and how much value my car has versus the van and then what the balance will be so I'll know how much cash I'm shelling out. Uh, so far, I don't know the answer to that yet, um, but he did promise me that it wasn't anywhere near what the other vehicle that I looked at was. So that I know then makes it within my budget. Um, let's make sure it stays within and maybe is a little less. So then that way I've got some extra gas money. That would be so nice. Um, yeah, so that's where I am right now. Uh, and... Whew, updates later.